When you start creating or mixing different blends together, and skin's a great example of this, there's lots of nuances in skin. We're not just singular dimensional in our in terms of the colors that are, that are represented. What is nice about it is if you got like a general sense of like four or five different skin tones, you know, from darks to lights and maybe even a little green in there, because you'll be surprised, and you add them onto your wet palette and blending them in different like little pools, then all of a sudden you can pick the right tone or the right color that you want to apply to a certain area. And even if you mess up, then you can go backwards and apply different nuances and different tones in different sections to create more realistic skin. You have this creative control of adjusting things, going back and forth, and having nuances in different places. Very cool thing to be able to have.